Welcome back to Energy and Cleaning. Today we are talking about 11 brilliant and genius ways to use these magic erasers. Now a couple tips here, make sure that you get them wet. I like to cut them up in little pieces like this because then you can use them all throughout your house and I think they last longer. And you wanna make sure that you get it wet. This is actually made out of melamine foam which was used for soundproofing and insulation. And some genius thought, hey, let me get this wet and clean some stuff up and here we have like this amazing household name. And at the end here, I'm also gonna show you something new and exciting and a bonus tip for you. The first way that I like to use this right here is if you have a curling iron or any sort of hair tool and you get hairspray stuck to it, use a wet magic eraser, you all, and it will get all of that grime off. This is also in one of my cardboard toilet paper hacks if you're interested in that. I can link that video below, but it helps keep the cord nice and organized right here, especially for travel. But yeah, just take your magic eraser and wipe off the surface and it will clean everything up and make everything work more efficiently. Right there, watch. That is like brand new. It's because of these teensy tiny little air pockets in there. You are in for a real treat, my friend. All right, check out my shower curtain liner. Can you see all the orange, like right there, the mildew that has built up? If you wanna keep these lasting for longer and make them white again, again, just take your magic eraser. This works like magic, literally, look at that. All that soap scum wiping right off. Now I do recommend if you are gonna be using magic erasers, make sure that you don't use it on any sort of finished wood or glossy surface and always test a small area first. Your cell phone cover, you guys, this accumulates so much stuck on stuff between the stuff that's stuck on my hands, uh, the stuff that's stuck on whatever surface that I end up putting it on, I often put it in my back pocket. So who knows, I have four kids and there's a lot of randomness that floats around our house, but use it as a cell phone case cleaner. Let's say you had an old food container of some sort and it got some nice permanent marker on there. You all, I think this is one of the best. Well, I love all these ways to use magic eraser. It just gets everything off remarkably well. Look at the inside of my microwave right here. This works excellent on handles as well. This is white, this is yellow. Go ahead, take your magic eraser. Watch this shine it right up and I'm gonna be so, oh my word you guys, look at that. Ugh. Do you see that spot right there? Oh yeah, yeah baby. Feeling good about that one. Wow, was this? I can't believe that it had that much kicked on stuff. Do we notice a difference? Magic eraser? No magic eraser. The dreaded shower door, especially fiberglass. I love this for removing hard water stains and shining everything right up. Did somebody get permanent marker on your whiteboard? Have no fear, all you have to do is take your magic eraser and wipe it all down like that. By the way, do you wanna see the blog and video lineup for the rest of the month? Just kidding. Need to whiten up your shoes again? Grab your magic eraser and wipe them down and they will look brand new. Now these do start to disintegrate after a while and you will have to get a new one. That's why I do suggest cutting them up for small jobs such as this. But look at that, how much dirt that's picking up right there. Should we do one more? What is that? What is on this door? Gone. Heck, I should just clean this entire door with this magic eraser. Look at that difference. Bug guts or hard water salt on your headlights. I love this right here because it does not damage it and it gets everything up, makes everything look nice and shiny right here. I live here in Wisconsin, so in the summer there are a ton of bugs out and about. Look, whoa, wait, I knew it was bad. I didn't know it was that bad. And here is my fun special surprise. I love these thin erasers, you all. This is amazing. You can just tear these off whenever you need them, in your car, on the go, in your kitchen. So in fact, this is one of the most functional ways that I use magic erasers in my house. My kids get stuff on the doors, which I, which I showed you, and also on the wall. It's just stuff adds up and then you start to wipe it with these. Like, this is amazing. I love the thicker ones, but this is really practical. Look at how easily. This is one of the best ways to clean anything on your wall. And let me take you over here super quick. The bonus tip here for you is this. I love cleaning with these. When you take this out, if you ever notice there's a lot of pink grime and residue inside of there, just give yourself, take a magic eraser, rinse everything out, and then wipe it down with one of these and it will clear everything right up. Since we're on a roll here, look at the downstairs shower. What is going on in here? 
Have no fear, my friend. Just get your magic eraser down in those grooves. And this is super pliable and flexible, uh, which I like. Just clean up along the lines right here. Like, what is what is accumulating around here? Oh my word. I will have these linked in the description box below to make it super easy for you to find them. Hard water spots right in here. This does a marvelous job of cleaning everything up, making it shiny again. I haven't had any issues. All right, if you enjoyed this video, I'd appreciate it if you gave it a thumbs up. Sign up for the newsletter when it comes to all things cleaning in the description box below and share this out to Pinterest and Facebook. And I will see you, my friend, in the next one.